Good morning, story time friends. Jocko, what are you holding? It looks like a jar of honey. Did you know that honey comes from bees? Today's story is Beehive by Jory Hurley. Can you see any bees on these flowers? Beehive by Jory Hurley. The buzzing sound that we hear comes from their wings moving really, really fast, really quickly. They swarm, that means they get together in a big group when they want to go from an old hive to start a new beehive. Some of them explore they stay pretty close together, but they some of them explore looking for a place to, to build a new beehive. They might find a hollow tree, which is a great place for a beehive. So when they find it, they do a dance to show the other bees where it is. They build the hive by using wax that they make in their bodies. They build on the, the top and the side of the, of the hollow tree. They're very busy, that's why we sometimes say busy bees. And the queen bee lays an egg in each one of the cells, the wax cells that they make in the hive. They feed, the, um, the eggs hatch into larvae, which are like small, short worms. And they feed the larvae sometimes a thousand times a day. They're very hungry. And the larvae grow up to be bees. Then they fly out looking for nectar, which is kind of a juice inside flowers, and pollen, which is kind of a dust in the flowers. They collect the, the pollen and the nectar. You can see it's on their legs. That's how they carry it through the air. When they carry that, that dust, that pollen, from flower to flower, some of it rubs off on the other flowers, and that's how the flowers make seeds. Some of the bees stay behind at the beehive just in case they have, a, have Another animal like a, like a bear or a skunk tries to steal some of the honey, so some of them stay behind to guard the beehive. And if the animal gets too close, they might sting it. 
like they're stinging this skunk. When it turns fall, you can see the, the orange leaves on the trees. They need to keep some of that honey in their hive so that they, the bees and the larvae, can eat honey during the, the winter because there are no flowers in the winter so they can't collect it then. So they need to keep some of it to eat. And here's a picture of that good honey and the bees eating the honey. Goodbye, storytime friends. Hope you see some bees in the flowers outside. <laughs>